Hello everyone, today I want to show you how to install Windows 2016 on BMI machine. The first thing you need an ISO file for Windows Server 2016. You can simply download it from Microsoft website. Here you just select ISO evaluation version for 180 days select the ISO continue fill up this form you can give your information it doesn't matter and then click on continue and it will start download so I give my information company name company size, position, email address, and then country, continue language English and download so save the file where you want to save it and then we'll come to our next things how to initial 2015 on BMware so I open VMware alright when you download it download completed just open your virtual machine and then click on create a new virtual machine select typical and then look at the file wherever you download it in my case I download on my particular folder and I select it and click open click on next you can give your name whatever name you like or I just write in server 2016 click next and then just show the folder where you want to save this your Windows Server machine like BMDK files so I just wherever you want by default it goes in C drive but you can select wherever you want to save it can click OK click on next oh because I had the virtual machine already in that drive so what I will do I just delete that particular virtual machine So I just remove that existing things and just click next. I gave the size 30 GB. Select store the virtual disk to the single drive. And then just finish. Alright. You can just remove this option floppy don't use floppy so just make it clear don't need to use this one and you can keep the as simple as it is by default don't worry about this so just ok and then we are ready to run our virtual machine so here yeah.
so whenever I'm just telling whatever I did when you click power on select the virtual machine area just you need to click your mouse in here and then as quick as possible just press any key to continue and then just select your country or currency country whatever let's go so I select English English Australia English Australia where is it Australia Australia oh, so far away from it okay. English Australia keyboard type of course US click next click install now just wait and then I'm selecting data center but it's got unlimited power rather than the standard but must select the desktop experience otherwise you will not get the graphical user interface okay click next of course you have to accept Microsoft license hundred percent you know here you must select the custom show your hard disks I mean the virtual hard disks of course next and the rest of the thing will done by Windows installation procedure So once the installation process finish it will restart automatically just need to give a password here but remember that you need to give the complexity of the password it's the requirement like uppercase lowercase and special character I give the password like this you can give a bell or whichever you like password and then finish and then you need to press alt or control delete to unlock in this case go to bm and then send Alt or Control Delete and the give the password which one we just gave in the settings and then click looks like it's working isn't it yeah this one just simply click yes if you want to discover your PC I mean server on your private network I mean in this network and then to be fine so here is our server is ready for VMware so now one more thing I want to show you this the screen size is not full screen on the VMware so for this reason you have to just need to add some extra feature from VMware um, 
yeah so if you click on vm and then install vmware tools it will come here in the bottom just click on there vmware select the choose happen on this day. so just click whatever i did or you can once you click here on vm and then because i already selected that's why it's cancel vm2 otherwise it should be vmware tool installation simply you can go like as you go to my computer and then select your cd-rom you know so once you click over there there will be automatic virtual virtual cd-rom drive come up and then it will show all the installation process just simply double click on this to fix the problem to see the full view click next next install it's like next 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 and next nothing else probably it will ask for restart i'm not sure yes it is asking for restart permission once it will be restart you can see the full screen on vmware windows 2016 yeah looks like it's working so same process just vm send control ultra delete give you a password my case i'm giving mine enter there you go this came up to full screen so those that's all about the installation of windows 2016 server on vmware machine i hope it will be helpful for some people and thank you very much